morning guys in this video we are going to see why we hurt our shoulders when we are doing bench press whether it's with barbell or with dumbbells and also some people might also get wrist pain when do their uh, bench press especially with dumbbells so the reason for that could be many uh, one of the reasons could be that your uh, that your technique sucks and we will be covering it in a separate video but for today if your uh, if your technique is good then what you need to know about the body and uh, body in relation to bench press is that most of us we have a tendency to lean on our right uh, when we are you know like standing sitting walking whatever day to day activity is unfortunately though that tendency does not go away when we are training also so what happens is when you are doing a bench press when you are doing a bench press when your hip is tilted to the right, your rib cage on the left flares out. And to maintain contact with the rib cage, your arm naturally abducts outwards. So abduction is this motion that is away from your torso. It abducts outwards and also your wrist extends. So uh, it's a body's natural, <coughs> natural reaction to a flared rib cage. Uh, so add to this the weight of the barbell or the dumbbell. So with a tilted hip and a uh, flared rib cage, you are doing uh, doing the bench press, and as you see, the uh, shoulder is already in a very very extended uh, in a very you know abducted position. At this point, your it's no longer your pec muscles which are getting loaded. It is mostly the mus small muscles here in the uh, armpit, uh, namely coracobrachialis, which uh, is. Uh, responsible for abducting arm at this angle so this way it is hurting very badly without the weight add to this the weight and it, it is a recipe for disaster to correct this you are going to need two dumbbells and some free space on the floor and what i want you to do is lie down first keep the dumbbells ready uh, Lie down, exhale, posteriorly tilt your hip, tuck, that is tuck your tailbone in and lift your hip up just a little bit. Now you can see if your hip is tilting to the right, what I want you to do is press down on the left leg and bring your hips to a level. Once your hips are leveled, your ribcage is going to be set much more nicely on your rib cage. Once you are there in that position of good alignment, start doing a floor press. Breathe in, breathe out. Press, breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. While ensuring that throughout the exercise, your hips are remaining level. So as you are doing the exercise, do not let your hip to turn this way. Make sure your hip is hips are leveled and then you are pushing, doing the push exercise. Also a quick tip on the, uh, on the bench press exercise is that do not abduct your arm out like this when you are doing a bench press. So for bench press, you are better off by keeping your hands closer to your torso then away so like this at about 30 degrees angle and then push off this is going to be very safe for your shoulder and also this is going to hit your chest way better than keeping your arms out like this so guys hopefully this trick is going to help you build a good chest while also keeping your shoulder joints happy.